Amber has allegedly been caught violating the law in a new video. The actress has been under hot water for a long period now, as more and more details about her past keep coming out. She's allegedly seen driving drunk in her car without a seatbelt on in a now viral video. It's unclear when the event happened, however. So what exactly was the video? What do people have to say about it? Keep watching to find out. An old video from Amber's Instagram page has gone viral again. The actress captioned it, Cruising with Bestie, and it showed her driving her Mustang without a visible seatbelt. Many also pointed out she might be drunk as well, and this is resulting in severe backlash for the actress. It's unclear as to when exactly the original video took place. Some also allege that she might actually be wearing a seatbelt on her lap, as that is how Mustangs were made. Moreover, some are also disappointed with the actress for her alleged reckless driving when she has been in trouble for driving accidents in the past. A tweet says, So, what are you, drinking after one drink that made you tipsy? One whiskey sour isn't going to get me drunk. I doubt it would for the majority of people. On that, a user replied that alcohol tolerance varies greatly between individuals. If in doubt, avoid driving altogether. Some countries prohibit driving with any amount of alcohol in your blood, even if you're not tipsy, so there's that. Another added that those old Mustangs lack shoulder belts. Lap belts are only available if you're lucky, and they'd have been very low belts, so she could have worn one. One of the users also stated that she's such a liar for claiming she hasn't heard of Carly Simon. You're so self-centered. One more added that, didn't she kill a friend as a teenager in a drunk driving accident? A fan replied that she hasn't learned anything after nearly 20 years. Simply reckless. Another said that she was arrested for driving without a seatbelt, lol. The officer who pulled her over was from the vehicular homicide division. I'm not sure if that's the correct name. And when people saw the arresting papers, they assumed she had killed someone. But that's not the case as far as I can see. Another comment says that she truly believes she is all of these things, when in reality, she is a deranged nobody. People like her disgust me completely. A user stated that it gives me the vibe of, I know I'm hot, so I'm going to take advantage of it and everyone will believe me because of my privilege. One more fan added, I realize this is an old post and I'm not sure if she's drunk. However, her general demeanor and facial expressions irritate me. She is simply, ugh. A fan replied, her exaggerated facial expressions irritate me greatly. This demonstrates her insanity. Another fan replied, I've never seen someone I thought attractive on the surface come across as plainly grotesque ugly in her every moment of living is this. A fan said, she always appears to believe she has accomplished something significant. She has only succeeded in making you cringe. Unfortunately for her, she will no longer be able to use her looks after having bookshelves installed beneath her eye sockets. One said, very nice car, very classy. I'm curious when this was completed. It appears to be years ago before she had children. And Isaac Baruch mentioned, I really want her to move on, heal and accept responsibility. Maybe she can have some fun again. On that, one replied that it's most likely Amber's old Mustang, which Johnny had rebuilt for her. Was the song selection also intentional? I'm relieved he's no longer with her. One more added that, in California, driving without a seatbelt automatically results in a traffic stop. That is not a game we play here. We have the highest rate of seatbelt use in the country because there are too many jerks who do this. She's a terrible person. A reply came saying, right? It's just a matter of habit for me to fasten my seatbelt. And at least two of the three major accidents I've been in, I was thankful I was wearing my seatbelt because I could have been easily gone through the windshield otherwise. I lived in Illinois for a year and was astounded by how many people either did not wear their seatbelts at all or did so incorrectly. Even a guy I was dating at the time would click the seatbelt in and sit on top of it to avoid the seatbelt alarm screaming at him. It was unbelievable to me. One added that she is the worst performer. She can't even sing along to a song and look good doing it. Amber seems to be one of those pretty girls who always got what she wanted and thus developed no personality. Another tweet says, is there any evidence that she was intoxicated in this video? I wouldn't rule it out, but I'm not going to pull an AH and make claims based on nothing. Another replied that, I believe her sister was projecting when she said, I was rarely sober. One more reply says that driving fast while not wearing a seatbelt isn't enough. Do you think Amber should address this video? Let us know in the comments down below. Make sure to like and subscribe for more.